My name is Adam Smith from NobelPrize.org. Is it possible, please, to speak briefly with Professor Manabe? Oh, just a second. Thank you. Um, hello. Hello, yes. Uh, many, many congratulations on the award of the Nobel Prize. Oh, thank you. We, we end. The, there's much excitement downstairs, I can hear. Everybody's very happy. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I never thought that I would receive a uh, Nobel Physics Prize for the work I have done. Uh, a uh, long time, which I enjoyed very much, but it uh, has been doing science of climate change. And when I look at all these four as distinguished recipients, uh, nobody uh, received physics prize uh, for uh, my kind of work. Mm. And uh, I uh, really appreciate that the uh, 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 Swedish Academy of Science to choose this field, uh, 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 climate topics of climate change, which I enjoyed very much to do throughout my lengthy career, which lasts more than 60 years. And uh, so uh, I am so surprised, but at the same time, I really appreciate that um, Swedish Academy of Science uh, chose my research mm. uh, for this honor of this year. I suppose they want to show how important a fundamental scientific understanding of the climate is. Uh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. I, I think this one of the important things is uh, understanding climate change. And what I did was using climate model which I constructed, changing one thing at a time, and uh, just like a chemistry, uh, do a chemical chemistry experiment. Yes. We, I made a numerical experiment using this model, changing one thing at a time, thereby understanding how climate system works and how uh, uh, temperature change, how rainfall change, and why these changes results in the uh, uh, massive flooding which has been occurring uh, near Beijing and in Japan, and all these massive flooding, and how this very frequent drought has been occurring all over the world. And I try to understand it using a climate model, why this is happening. Mm. I think... My most important thing is understanding climate change. The prediction of climate change uh, without accompanied understanding of it is same, no better than prediction of fortune terror. <laughs> such an important topic, such an important problem. Yeah. Um, yeah. And... Almost everybody agrees about the importance of it. But tell me, why did you begin to be interested in meteorology and the climate in the first place? What drew you to the subject when you were young? Yeah, you know, it was, uh, I went to uh, uh, graduate school of uh, uh, University of Tokyo. Then uh, this uh, graduate school of geophysics. Uh, I fo decided to focus on uh, uh, meteorology. At that time, uh, the weather forecasting <laughs> yes. was uh, more of art rather than science. Uh, you know, look at the past weather map and make a yes. forecast based upon the uh, sort of country and the experience. But uh, at that time, 
uh, at the uh, Institute of uh, Advanced St- St- Study. Von Neumann, who is a pioneer of uh, computers, among many other things, decided to uh, do um, uh, weather forecasting uh, based upon laws of physics, which is a hydrodynamical equation, right? Mm. And uh, so he started small groups and, and started studying uh, weather forecasting. And this is uh, the uh, beginning of uh, daily uh, weather forecasting, which has become indispensable for our daily life. Over your career, you've seen weather forecasting and climate prediction change from art no. to science. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's, yeah. It, it's been a pleasure to talk okay. to you. And my, my, my uh, congratulations. Hello. Hello, it's yeah. Adam. Here. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And congratulations. Okay, what a what a day. What a day. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Bye bye. Bye. If you enjoyed this moment, you might also like this special edition of the Nobel Prize Conversations podcast. Adam Smith takes a turn as guest and recalls his favourite moments from these very special calls.